Can you say hi? Hi. Say hi. What's this? Hi. Eggs. Today on Cooking with Clive, we're having more fun with eggs. Eggs are amazing. There's a lot of things you can do with eggs. They're very versatile. You can bake with them. You can cook with them. Oh, they're amazing. What a wonderful treat. Are you starting Daddy's car? Yeah. Starting your car. Are we going to go for a drive after this? Yeah. Maybe. We'll see. Only if you drive. Let's have fun with eggs today. We're going to make what? Eggs. Eggs. We're going to make scotch eggs today. Scotch eggs are a wonderful, delicious treat I used to eat when I was in England all the time. Mind you, when I was in England, I'd be grabbing them at Tesco Express or Boots or some place where they're probably pretty terrible, but at the time, uh, I, uh, I love them. Um, Cheese. So we're going to make scotch eggs today. Do you want to do that? Cheese. You want to tell the people what scotch eggs are? Cheese. Oh. Cheese. Okay. We're just making keys today, I guess. Nope. Scotch eggs. Coming at you. Say, let's go. No. Eggs. He's right. They're eggs. So we're making Cheese. scotch eggs today. Um, so first step is we're going to soft boil some eggs and eat a muffin. Um, so we're going to soft boil some eggs. So I get some water in here, uh, boiling water. Get the water boiling first, and then we're going to submerge our eggs in it. Set a timer for six minutes. And then at six minutes, we're going to pull the eggs out, throw them in a nice bath, and they'll be perfectly soft boiled eggs. Hey Google, we're not quite there yet. We can't say, hey Google, soft boil some eggs for us. By the time you're my age, I bet you'll be able to do that. Someone can probably do that right now. Okay, ready? So, in the boiling water. Ooh, careful. Woo, careful. Woo, woo. Okay. Hey, Google, set timer for six minutes. Okay, so we're going to make scotch eggs. So, scotch eggs are the soft boiled egg wrapped in some breakfast sausage, right? Then we're going to bread them, and we're going to fry them, and they're going to be awesome. So what we're going to do is, here, can you squeeze, can you, can you squeeze all the sauces out of this casing? Look, just pinch the middle, and just squeeze, and it'll all come popping out. We're just using breakfast sauces that we had in our freezer, right? It's sort of a time where you just utilize what you have, and try and make some stuff out of it. So just squeeze all the sausage out of the casing. Can you do that? Squeeze, yeah, look. If you take it and you go pinch, then you go push, it all pops out. Can you squeeze this out? Here, can you take your hand? Just pinch it, pinch it tight, pinch it tight. And then go, what? Whoa, that's cool. Do you want to do that again? Ready? Pinch it, pinch it tight. No. No? Okay, daddy do it. So we're going to get all this breakfast sausage squeezed out, okay, to get rid of the casings. And then when the eggs are done and sort of cooled off, okay. We're going to wrap them in this sausage, bread them, and fry them up. All right. So I did about a dozen of these. So we have a nice pile of this. We're going to mix it all together, get it all ready, keep it nice and cold, wrap it around some eggs in a bit. Does that sound fun? Sticky sausage finger high five? Yeah. Oh. OK. Let's set up our breading station. Whoa! You're dropping your keys. Don't lose those. Okay. So our eggs are almost done. They're about to come out and go in an ice bath, okay? And then we're going to show you our breading station. Are you ready? Listen for the eggs. Here they come. Okay. Oh, there's our timer. Okay. Hi. Yeah. So. Ice. Eggs. Daddy's way back here. So I'm going to take the eggs out of the site, out of the hot water, drop them in. It's just a tub full of ice and ice baths, and cool them down instantly. Okay, you talk to them while I get the eggs. Okay? There's one egg in the ice bath. Two eggs in the ice bath. What's after two? Two. Three. What's after three? Two. <sighs> We're working on it. Home education is tough. We miss daycare, don't we? Okay, here's our rice bath. Okay, we're gonna set those eggs right there.
Okay. Bing. Okay. Let's talk Bye. about breading. What? Is that, is that ice? It's cold. Cold. Ooh. Those eggs must be chilly, eh? Yeah. So for the breading station, it's. Uh, <laughs> what's wrong? Get rid of that hat. Bye bye. For the breading station, your hair is crazy. Um, for the breading station, it's going to be flour, then an egg wash, then breadcrumbs. So the wet sausage no. is going to allow the flour to stick to it. And then that flour is going to go in the egg wash, and the egg wash is going to stick to the dry flour. And then the, dry, and then the egg wash is going to stick to the breadcrumbs. So wet sticks to dry, right? So wet to dry, dry to wet, and it's going to make a nice crust. So here's what we got. Yeah. So we're going to start off by dipping them in just flour, salt and pepper. Then it's flour, yucky. Then we're gonna dip them in our egg wash, so two eggs and some milk, beat up together. Then after that, we're gonna put them in the breadcrumbs that we made. We made them for our uh, musco salad a couple days ago. We still have some left over. So first we're gonna make a big mess with those, and then we're gonna bread up our eggs. But first, we gotta wrap our sausage around our eggs. So let's do that next. Toast? Toast, little bits of toast, yeah. You are going to make a mess today. It's going to be super fun. Here we go. Toast? Yeah, toast. Oh, yucky toast. Oh, I'd rather scotch eggs. Let's make scotch eggs. We have Ice. some sausage and some eggs. So I'm sure there's lots of different ways people do this, but I kind of just get in there, take a chunk of this sausage, okay? and just start flattening it out in my hand. I just press it, press it down, press it, keep turning it, pressing it. Just press it out as thin as you can get, right? It's gonna be sticky, but that's part of the fun, right? We like playing with sticky stuff, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, so let me just press it out nice and thin. Get this sausage, and like I said, this is store-bought sausage. If you wanna buy some ground pork and add some nice spices to it, a little bit of maple syrup, whatever, uh, just use the Google machine and find a cool recipe. Okay, once I get it down thin, I just sort of take one of our eggs, pop it in the middle, and just start folding it up around the egg. So just start folding it up, okay? So you're folding it, don't be too shy, don't be worried, just start pinching. So I got it like this, and I'm just pinching, I'm just pulling the sausage in around the egg, pinch, pinch, just delicately with your fingers, just sort of just massaging the sausage up around the egg. The opening's getting smaller and smaller each time I do it, okay? Oh just keep pulling that up. The opening's pretty much gone now. I'm gonna pinch it all together. The egg's gone, okay? Keep doing it a few times to seal it in. Pat this down, sort of form up your, form up your ball. So now we have a nice egg wrapped in sausage. You ready to do the other two? Do you, want, do you want to try one? Do you want to try one? Yeah, let's get you to do one. Okay, all right. Are you ready? Daddy, flatten this down for you. We'll see how long uh, how long it lasts before yolk ends up all over our island. But my that's part of the fun, right? Learning. You got to try it. You got to be brave enough to suck at stuff for a while, right? And then eventually you won't suck at it anymore. You'll be good. Be comfortable being uncomfortable. Learn new things. If making a scotch egg intimidates you, make it. Mess it up. Mess my it up a dozen times. My turn. The thirteenth time you'll get it right. Okay, my are you time. ready? Okay, I'm gonna put this right here. Okay. Move. Can you fold that? Can you fold that up around that egg? Be gentle. Be gentle. Yep, that's it. Look. Fold it. Fold it. No. Fold it. Look. Oh, it's all going up around there. Can you fold it? Look, can you do this with your hand? Daddy, hold this. Can you just go pinch? Pinch, pinch, pinch. Can you do that? Yep, squeeze, squeeze. Take your fingers, wrap it around the whole thing, and just sort of pull all your fingers together. And it's going to pull all the meat around it. Can you try that? Yeah, that's it. That's it. You got it. You're doing great. You're doing fantastic. Mr. Ambrose Clive, I think you... Can you, oh, it needs a little bit more. Can you do a little bit more? Can you pinch a little bit more? Oh, yeah. Good job. Look at that. Ambrose Clive, you, 
me the first pair of a Scotch egg. Sticky sausage high five again. Yeah. All right. Now well, let's go wash our hands. No. Yes. No. Yes. Okay. So we have our Scotch eggs wrapped in sausage. We have our breading station set up. We have blackberries uh, to munch on while we're doing it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna season our flour, our eggs, and our breadcrumbs with salt and pepper, right? I like to season all the different layers of things. Okay, get that seasoning all through everything, okay? Now it's a pretty simple process. Uh, a lot of people like to keep sort of one hand wet, one hand dry. We'll see how it goes. Uh, we're just gonna go for it. So we're gonna take our scotch egg, which the sausage is sticky. Roll that in flour, okay? Then we're gonna dip it in our egg so the flour was dry. Now the wet egg sticks to that. Now we have the wet egg. We toss that in our breadcrumbs and I am Gonna get my hands all messy here, but it's gonna be fun. Okay, don't be afraid of making a mess uh, when you're cooking. Just clean it up as you go, okay? Now we have one beautiful breaded scotch egg right there. Let's do that with the other three. So flour, okay? This is called a breading station, okay? So when you bread things, it gets a nice crispy coating on it that won't fall off, okay? So any type of breadcrumb will do. Um, I make my own sort of with stale bread, uh, but panko is a really good one. Uh, any breadcrumb, your grocery store will sell it to you. Just go to the bakery section, they'll have little bags of breadcrumb. Okay, all right, scotch egg number two. Two? Two, what comes after two? Three. Three, okay. Do you wanna do the last one? You're doing the last one, okay? Daddy's gonna wash his hands, and you're gonna do the last scotch egg here, okay? You ready? No. Okay. I bet you can't make more of a mess than Daddy already did. We'll see. Okay, there's three scotch eggs. Oh, you're gonna do this. Can you, can you bread this? Oh, look at the mess Daddy has. I bet you can beat it though. Okay, can you take this egg right here, and put it in flour, and then put it in egg, and then put it in breadcrumbs? Okay, do it. <laughs> so we're at the stove. I have my cast iron pan just with sort of half an inch of oil in it. I'm just gonna shallow fry these, roll them around, get them golden uh, all around, and then I'm gonna finish them off in the oven. Um, normally I would just drop them in sort of a deep fryer, uh, but we're going with what we got at home, we're trying to do it as safe as possible, so Ambrose is pretty far away, and you're gonna watch this, right? Yeah, dangerous, this is dangerous. Okay, so I'm just gonna take our scotch eggs, just drop them in, And they won't be in long, I'm just sort of browning up the edges. Just getting them GBD, golden brown delicious. So I put three in, Ambrose I'm gonna hold off. It may have been ripped open during the mashing process, but we'll see. So just fry them up in here, rolling them over every once in a while until you feel that they're golden brown delicious. And then we'll put them in a 350 degree oven um, just for a few minutes, just to cook that sausage through. The sausage is super thin, so the frying normally sort of cooks it most of the way, but we'll just finish it off. But we don't want to cook the egg too much. The yolk needs to be runny, so it's a delicate thing, but with practice, you figure it out. Okay, buddy, let's roll some of these over. They don't need long, do they? No. No. Look at that one. Oh, they look yummy, don't they? Oh, they're gonna look yummy. Mm. Yeah, it is hot, so it's dangerous, right? So we don't come near it, okay? Okay, so our scotch eggs are all sort of golden brown and delicious. I'm gonna transfer them onto uh, some paper towel for a second. Then I'm gonna pop them on a baking sheet in a 350 degree oven for like, I don't know, five minutes or so just to cook them through. 
and then uh, we'll be ready to eat some scotch eggs. So that's exciting. Yeah. Yeah, is that exciting? Yeah, out. Is this yours? Yeah, out. This one's yours. Ooh, the experiment. We'll see. Yeah, out. Okay. Yeah, out. Three scotch eggs right here. Huh? Want to put these in the oven? Here we go. Okay, we'll give that a few minutes and then it'll be time to munch on some scotch eggs. Oh, a little hot sauce. Oh, I can't wait! Okay, so uh, just for fun, um, to go with our scotch eggs, I'm gonna try and microwave some potato chips. Um, I was sort of cruising around the internet, obviously uh, on some downtime and just like stumbled upon someone microwaving potato chips. So I was like, yeah, why not try that to go with my scotch eggs? So um, I used a mandolin and cut my potatoes super thin, um, as you're gonna see right here. Once I got the potatoes cut real thin, I put them in a bowl with water, submerged in water, sort of try to pull as much starch out of there as I could. So once the water's sort of clear, then I'm just taking them and I'm putting them on this, uh, just a dishcloth, just a nice clean dishcloth. And I'm gonna try and dry them out as much as I possibly can, okay? Get them all nice and dry with the dishcloth, put them on one side, I'm gonna fold it over Okay, pat these down, pat these down, okay. Get them nice and dry, let those dry for a little bit. Then I'm gonna season them with some salt, arrange them uh, on this plate with some sort of paper towel underneath, and just microwave them for six minutes. We'll see how it happens. This could be a great addition to this, or it could be a terrible addition to this, but it's all about experimenting and having fun. So, yeah, let's do it. Okay, so I have a plate with some paper towel on it. I have my nicely dried out potatoes. Okay, nice and dry. Okay, the drier you get them, the better this is gonna work. So these have been sitting out here for a little while, 20 minutes or so. Uh, I'm just going to... I hear a chainsaw coming. Where were you when I was slicing potatoes, mister? Huh? Okay, so I got some seasoning on these. I'm just gonna place them on this plate uh, without touching. If they're touching, they won't get crispy. Oh, now you wanna see what's going on, eh? Look, is Daddy making potato chips? Is this an experiment? Don't be afraid to experiment, buddy. Huh? Try something. Hopefully it fails and you learn something. Potatoes? Potatoes, okay? Don't let them touch each other, okay? So we kinda have them just laid out on this plate here. Uh, and we're gonna throw them in the microwave for three minutes, flip them over, another three minutes. Okay? Okay, we'll check back in three minutes. Okay, as you can see, the chainsaw is still running. It's pretty much uh, constantly, ow! Constantly going uh, as long as somebody's awake. Okay, so that's been three minutes. Let's check our potatoes. Potatoes? Potatoes? Uh, they're looking a little dry. They're drying up, they're bubbling up. Uh, I'm not super optimistic, but we'll give it another. Right now, they're still pretty soft. I mean, they're cooked, but they're still pretty soft. So I'm gonna put some more salt on here. Okay, and uh, put them back in for another three minutes, and then we'll see. Three more minutes, buddy. Okay. I just canceled it. What am I doing? Three more minutes. That cold? Does that feel cold or hot? Huh? Cool. Look at these scotch eggs. Do they look awesome? Cool. They look pretty good. Now we gotta cut into them and see what they're like. You're like, oh! 
I said cut into them, not bite into them. Watch this. Watch this. Let's cut into these and see what they look like. I? Oh! The yolk is runny and beautiful. So here's our scotch egg looking beautiful. Yolk's a little runnier than I... Oh, no. Never mind. I take it back. That yolk's perfect. Okay? So let's put that on our plate. Here. Oh, you cut this one. Will you hold this? Okay. Cut down the middle. Oh! Cut down the middle. Oh, yeah. Now give Daddy the knife. Now flip it open. Oh, beautiful scotch eggs. Are you going to like these? I think you are. Okay, so... Well, potatoes. So our chips are kind of getting there. I mean, they're drying up a little bit. What do you think of this? Is that going to... Oh, they're kind of crunchy. I think another couple minutes and these might be where we need them to be. What do you think? My well, let's take them off this uh, paper towel. Okay. Transfer them just on the plate. Ooh, oh, that one's pretty crunchy. That one's actually pretty crunchy. We're getting there, bud. Let's just give them like another couple minutes. Two more minutes, I think. We might have some potato chips. No, my potato. No, my potato. Try that one. You try that one. See what you think. Okay, two more minutes. So that will be eight minutes all together. We'll check them out. How is it? There's a potential? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. All right, sweet. Can't wait to try them. Oh, I heard that crunch. These are coming together. <laughs> Look at these. Okay, so it's been oh, eight minutes total. And I mean, they're looking pretty good. Like That's looking like a decent little potato chip there. My what do you think? Huh? I think they're doing all right. Couple okay. little crispy chips. Are those yours? Let's uh, plate these up with some scotch eggs and have a nice little lunch. How was that? Mmm. Mmm. All right. Let's plate. Let's plate these bad boys up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, buddy. Are you eating those potato chips? Oh, look at the scotch egg and the potato chips and some hot sauce. Oh, are you gonna eat the chips? You wanna try some scotch egg? No. No? Oh, you're missing out. Another day, Daddy gets all the good stuff. You're just gonna concentrate. Oh, that's reminiscent right there. Bring me back to the UK. Mix in one of these microwave potato chips. They're pretty crunchy. This is alright. We're gonna enjoy this today. Yeah. Yeah. Can you say bye bye? My turn. Is that your fork? Yeah, use it to eat some scotch egg. You wanna use it to take a bite of scotch egg? No. What? Yeah, he will keep eating it. Can you say bye bye? Okay. You don't use the fork for potato chips. Huh? That's silly. Yeah. Yeah. Bye bye. No. Oh, mm.